What up farm? So today we're going to be hooking my tractor up to the spreader and we're going to get it set up so that dad can do some fertilizer spreading, spreading out the, the high carbon fertilizer, the biopril. Um, but first we've got to take a link out of the chain on the spreader. So we'll get her all hooked up and uh, start fixing. Right, we got it backed into the shed. Now we've got to look for the join in the chain. All right, been going for a while. I've got uh, got it all tightened up. Um, I ended up pulling out two links. Managed to work that I could pull out two. So that now we've got plenty of adjustment in our spring here. Um, there's one of them on either side. So we shouldn't have to touch it for a fair while now. So now I just got to pack up and uh, yeah, and we'll be good to go. So dad's scooping it out of the pile there, putting it in the spreader. And uh, yeah, we're gonna calibrate it and then we'll get stuck into it. in there now the reason we don't fill it up chocker block full on the first load is just in case something goes bad <laughs> and then we've got less to shovel out and we do this on pretty much everything on the first load just a little safety measure isn't it <laughs> here's our calibrating trays and our scales so we're going to be spreading at 18 metres and that means we need to turn the little wheel 21.7 times and that will give us one two hundredth of a hectare. Yeah. So we've got our trays in, now we've got to turn this wheel 21.7 times. One. Two. There we go, we can see what it's metered out there, which is quite a lot. There he goes. He's gonna go and spread out the first load. We've sort of got it calibrated, sort of just a guess. It was kind of frustrating us a bit more close, but not too sure how close. So he's gonna spread a load and then we'll see how close we were. Second calibration. Second calibration. We just gotta wait here. That's 2.5, which equals 11.5. Is that right? Yep. Times 40, 460 kilos. Good. So that's all calibrated. Perfect. What, what is it? It's Melbourne it's people poo. It's bio but what is it? It's Melbourne people poo. Ugh. Oh, gross. So from us farmers, we'd like to say thank you to the Melbourne people for good poo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it smells so bad.
Alright, so it's my turn to do some spreading today. Dad's gonna check some sheep. Um, yeah, let's go and do some. She's all filled up, ready to go for another load. All right, we made it back to the paddock and we've just started spreading. We've got about seven hectares to go in this paddock, which will probably all, be all of this box full. And then we'll be on to the next one after we have some lunch though. Over here at Christie's doing some spreading. Um, this is our last paddock before we've got to go out north. Um, what we're spreading is Bioprill, which actually comes from the sewage treatment plant at Lara. Yep, that's right, it's human waste. But it's cooked so that all the bugs and everything get out of it. So it's completely safe. Um, and we spread it on our paddocks because it is a very um, rich source of carbon. It's very carbon rich. Um, so you hear a lot about um, that in the media really, about farmers storing carbon in their soils. Well, it actually makes things grow better in our soils. Um, so that's what we're doing. Um, yeah, it, it works really good on sandy soils. So this, you can, might be able to see, might not. It's pretty sandy. This is a bit, bit of a heavier flat, but it's still pretty sandy. Um, yeah, so we're spreading it out, and hopefully it will go well. This paddock's gonna go into cereal rye this year for grazing, I think, and uh, yeah, it'll just help it grow. Look at this stuff. There's some rain falling on the window. 
didn't expect that. We're back to fill up again. to pick up another load. We're just over halfway through the paddock, but I've taken inspiration from uh, a fella that I follow on Instagram. His name is Heath Wibley. Um, check him out, he does some really cool drone stuff. Uh, but I've actually set up a GPS line, an AB line, a curve line, whatever you want to call it, so that it takes me from the gateway from the gateway of the paddock that I'm working on to the gateway onto the road. And I don't have to steer. Hashtag work smarter, not harder. We're filled up and spreading on the last load. On the last load for this paddock anyway. Well, there we go. It's all spread around here. Next week we'll have to head further north and finish off the spreading out there and then we'll be into the countdown for seeding. <laughs> 